to enable.org presents Mathematical Literacy Time of Day Okay, the difference in time between AM or PM Okay, now in the alphabet A is before P in the alphabet Remember the A the alphabet is A, B, C, D, E, F, G. So A is in the beginning of the alphabet and P is more or less closer to the end or almost at the end. So therefore AM is before PM during the day. AM is in the morning, PM is in the afternoon. So when we look at different times, we have a table with a column for time in the morning and in the afternoon. So 7 o'clock in the morning is 7 a.m. and in the afternoon it is 7 p.m. 10 o'clock in the morning is 10 a.m. and in the afternoon 10 p.m. okay so th this is really early in the morning 7 o'clock a.m. as the sun rises and in the afternoon 7 p.m. is the time that the sun sets 8 o'clock in the morning it's not so early anymore, then the school has already started. And that is 8 p.m. in the afternoon, almost well, an hour after sunset. 9 o'clock in the morning is 9 a.m., which is 9 p.m. in the evening. And then this time it's already dark in all parts of South Africa. And 10 a.m. in the morning and 10 p.m. is at night. Okay, so the difference between AM and PM, A is before P in the alphabet, so AM is before PM during a day. Right, the second kind of clock that we're working with is a 24-hour clock. Okay, now because there are 24 hours in every day, we can use a 24-hour clock. So the first 12 hours is during the morning. So 1 o'clock is in the morning and then the second 12 is in the afternoon. So what we do, okay, so 12, 12 o'clock is called midday because it is in the middle of the day. And then nought, nought, nought hours or 24 hours is called midnight because it is in the middle of the night. Okay, so when we go past 12 o'clock in the afternoon, we add 12 to the time on the analog clock, that clock with the, with the hands. What we do is we read the time, and to get to 24-hour time, we will add 12 to any particular time. So this is a table to quickly explain what I meant. Right, so this is the time, the time in the morning and the time in the afternoon. 1 o'clock in the morning will be 0100 hours and in the afternoon it will be 1300 hours. 4 o'clock in the morning will be 400 hours and that is 16 hundred hours in the afternoon. So what we do is we go 4 plus 12 and 4 plus 12 is 16 so 1600 hours is 4 o'clock. 6 o'clock in the morning is written as 600 hours. Oh, 600. And if we add six, uh, 12 unto 6 we get to 18 so 1800 hours is six, is 6 o'clock in the afternoon, 9 o'clock, we go 9 plus 12, and 9 plus 12 is 21, so 2100 hours is the same as 9 o'clock. Okay. Right, so ultimately when we have the time in 24 hours, so let's for instance say 20 hundred hours. If we want to know what twenty hundred hours is on an uh, how what what o'clock it is, we'll go twenty hundred hours minus twelve 
and 20 minus 12 is equal to 8. So 20 hundred hours will be 8 o'clock in, in the afternoon or in the evening. Right, so when we have um, the 24 hours clock to go from a time in the afternoon to how we, we usually speak because we, we don't say 20 hundred hours, we actually say 8 o'clock. So what we do is we take the time minus 12 from it and then we get to the time that we will read. Right, so here is a clock. What is the time? The long hand is on the 12, the short hand is on the 5. What time is it? Right, now if it is during the morning, we can either say, well, it is 5 o'clock in the morning on this watch or on this clock. Or we can say 5 a.m. Remember, A is before P in the alphabet, so AM is before PM during, during the day. So 5 AM is 5 o'clock in the morning. Or we can say 0500. Oh, right, so that is the three ways we can say what the time is on this clock. If it is during the afternoon, we can either say 5 o'clock in the afternoon, or 5 p.m. Remember, P is after A in the alphabet. So, p.m. is after a.m. during the day. Or we can say 5 plus 12. Now, let's quickly think, what is 5 plus 12? Right, how would we do it? We will say 2 plus 5 is 7. So 5 plus 12 is 17. Okay, so here the answer will appear. It is also 1700 hours. Okay. Thank you.